Howdy! Today we are going to win a game for you. I promise. <laughs> Please let us beat Crystal Palace. We've actually been doing really well lately since that defeat against Man United. We've a we're actually unbeaten, in fact. Um, nearly won winning every single game. 0-0 no, no draw against Everton. 3-2 win against QPR. 2-1 win against Villa. 3-0 no victory against Newcastle despite being down to 10 men. 2-1 win against Bury in the FA Cup. 2 all draw against Spurs. 2-1 win against Stoke and then a 1-0 win against Brentford in the FA Cup fourth round. Meaning that we're in a good position in the table. Uh, we, we're sort of mid-table um, in the last video. But we've pushed up a bit, up to 34 points. 9 wins, 7 draws, 6 defeats. Goal difference of plus 4. Moved above Everton and Liverpool. And we should comfortably finish top 10 this season. Right? If Well, as long as we carry this run on. Um, and we've even got a slim chance of getting into Europe, I guess. <coughs> so, the question is, can we win a game live in an episode? Because, I mean, this series has flopped, to be honest. It's not so good. Uh, it started off okay, but we're just not winning any games, and you're probably getting a bit bored of me losing all the time. So, this is the team I've gone for. Three up front, and it's worked well lately. Sacco is going to be playing as the target man simply because Carroll has been, has been useless. Not done anything. Trying to offload him. There's still a few days left of the January transfer window. I've tried to get rid of Cole, Nolan, Vaste, and Carroll, in fact. Uh, but none of, I haven't managed to get rid of any of them thus far, uh, which is a shame. Uh, so I might have to hang on to them. Obviously, ideally, I'd want to get you know about 10 million for Carroll, but I don't think that's likely. I'm not expecting to get anything for the other three. I'm going to show you this game in 2D Classic for a change, just so you can see the 2D match engine if you haven't seen that yet. Uh, just for a change. Fancy watching it in 2D. As the 3D thing does annoy me, and it does look like Bambi on ice, doesn't it, at times? Okay. Let's keep. Let's just do this and ask the strikers to, to make a difference. So, we're away against Palace. Let's hope that we can win. Zerate, come on, lad. Three already. Sacco. All three strikers have got plenty of goals, which is good. Uh, well, you can't really ask for much more than that. Um, I think Sacco's up to ten. Zerate's got eleven. Valencia's got nine. I think so that's pretty decent and Valencia has been injured for a while so that's not bad at all here goes Punchin looks a bit ominous here but Noble wins the ball well done Creswell up to Downing who's back from injury now this is his first game back for three months I think Valencia through Valencia saved unlucky crossing's not working so let's just see what old Mackie D says uh, ball in, oh, get it away, Chris. Well down and clears, well done. Sometimes switch Valencia and Zerate because they both can play either advanced forward or deep line forward. They're versatile, so I sort of switch, switch their roles around, see what works in a game. But here goes Zahar, looking dangerous, skips past whoever that was, and punch and scores. Why can't we? bloody take the lead in any of these videos either. There's the 3D uh, replay. Zahar, fantastic ball and punch is just unmarked. Where was Creswell? That's irritating. Okay. Throw in. Zerate. Zerate scores. Brilliant stuff from a Creswell throw. 12th goal of the season. He's just so good. He's a bit inconsistent but his attributes are unbelievable. Being called up to the Chile squad in real life, thanks to his father being Chilean. Uh, he used to play youth team football for Argentina back in the day. We can still win this. You need to... Oh, nothing really happened there. But, um... Okay. What should we do? Exploit the flanks, maybe? We don't really have any wingers, do we? Look for overlap. And then low crosses, I think. See how that works. 
Uh, is it hard? Oh, good tackle, Jenkinson. Ah, oh, great stuff. Creswell win it. Yes. You're playing an injured guy. Tackle him, Creswell. Oh, no, MacArthur. It's just open there for him. This doesn't look good, does it? This really doesn't look good at all. 2-1. When are we going to bloody win a game? When I'm recording. It's so frustrating. This formation has worked well. As you can see, I've been unbeaten for the past few games. And then suddenly, we can see twice against Palace. Exploiting our flanks. I know we don't have any wingers in this team, but I, I've asked Valencia to drift out wide. Zerate is meant to sort of just roam from his position. Sacco! Oh. I think that's probably a poor first touch. What just drifted away from him. Downing, good header. Sacco, this time Valencia's through. Valencia, come on! Oh. We need to score those opportunities, don't we? Winston Reid, uh, nothing. Hmm. How are we going to turn this around? Downing's a bit dead, but he's playing well. But because of his uh, his injury, he's not fully fit yet. So I'll bring him Alfitano on. I think uh, Enna Valencia is just not having a very good game at all. So Carroll's going to come on as the target man. And we're going to lump it up to him. <laughs> Get stuck in. Um, there we go. Let's see, Carroll, Carroll really needs a goal because he hasn't scored yet, and he's played a fair number of games now since coming back from injury. Oh, what I mean, what was that? That's just a waste of a free kick. Closing down. Well done, Poet. So the the one problem is um, Song and Kiate are on international duty because duty because of international the African Cup of Nations thing, which is a bit irritating. Well done, which means I'm a bit lacking in central midfield now, which is why I have reverted to three up th front simply because I don't have enough midfielders. Carol, oh what that was awful, Sacco. You've been really good lately, and that was just a really poor finish. Had to score that. I thought he was offside, but maybe he thought he was offside. But that was awful. Oh, these that person's crossings are deadly. And offside. That Bojan Jokic guy on the left, absolutely deadly left foot. Uh, that was that miss was annoying. I'm going to have to bring him off for that, but there's not really anyone to... Oh, no, I can't take him off, can I? Noble's really been poor. Morrison's going to come on. It's such an attacking lineup. up it's, It really is risky, but somehow it has been relatively solid so far up to this game. And now we've conceded twice. Typical, eh? Going to have to go overload. Come on, guys. Please get an equaliser at least. That Jokic guy has been insane. So Zahar's been very good. As has Punchin, as has all of their team, to be fair. Oh, they're really spreading as wide. Get him! Put pressure! Ah, oh, they're playing really well. Uh, we're just being exposed down the wing so bad. Why have I played this formation? Come on, guys. Please, one more opportunity. I think it's all over. One more minute. An equaliser, please. Zerate, come on. Out wide to Jenkinson. Malfitano, lovely ball out wide to Creswell. Cross it in. Ah, oh, no. Zerate! Oh, Carol, you could. Oh. oh, how did you miss Carol? 
this series is useless. I've not won a single game in any episode whatsoever. I'm still reasonably high up the league, but you don't get to see see my good games. That's irritating. Being sl slightly critical of them with a calm. Look, we actually dominated shots wise. They did dominate possession. Well, that's a disappointing defeat against mid table Crystal Palace. Who were towards the bottom, actually. Uh, <laughs> oh, I can't believe it. I'm tempted to show you the Burnley game as well. How long is this video? Quite long. I'm going to show you the Burnley game. This is going to be an extra long episode for you. Okay, <laughs> we better win this. Uh, maybe it's the curse of recording in this series. I just can't seem to win whatever I do. Really irritating. So, Burnley, 17th from the table. We have to beat them. Not responding now. Here we go. Okay, match preview. Uh, team, I we'll stick with the same team. Oh, Alex Song is back. We won't stick with the same team. Andy Carroll's been irritating, hasn't he? Really irritating. So Song's coming into the team. Kiate still on international duty. I presume his team's still in it then. And the problem I think in the last game was maybe I was attacking a bit too much with the fullbacks. So. I'm changing them back to fullback rather than wing back. That may make a difference. And I'm going to play Valencia as the deep lying forward and Rosarate as the advanced forward and see if that has any difference. I'm ready for this. Had a salad. Quite a big bowl, in fact. Some lovely uh, low fat salad cream on top. Scrumptious. So, come on, guys. We need to win. Yes, Noble with lots of lots of appearances. They're playing wide. Oh. Perhaps I shouldn't be playing three up front because it's quite narrow. But then well, Upton Park has a narrow pitch, so it sort of should work. But Danny Ings is going to be dangerous. He's got a few goals this season. Let's just, yeah, let's say we're favourites and see how that works. Be aggressive. Well, not aggressive, passionate. And we don't really need to pump the ball into the box. Um, we're going to get stuck in. We, we need to just show some heart. And I'm going to show it on the other 2D today. The special 2D. Not 2D classic. Special 2D. Here we go. Look at that. You can see what way they're facing with those little arrows. Bum, 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 ba dum, ba dum, bum. Bum, 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 ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. I have to stay positive. We're high up in the table. The only problem is we just don't win. I, when I uh, when I record, and most of the matches have been big games. To be fair, Palace is disappointing. We didn't play well. We had plenty of chances, but the strikers were awful, and we just were punished by their width. Come on, Downing Song back from African Cup of Nations, which is good. Jenkinson Sacco scores. Lovely cross and Sacco with his 11th goal of the season. Worked well as the target man there. Great cross from Jenkinson. Let's see it in 3D. Jenkinson. Beautiful ball and Sacco just beat his man. Simply found the back of the net. Corner. Creswell. Tompkins. Oh, no, didn't get to him. Valencia's on the ball though. Crosses in. Oh, Sacco hits the post. Unlucky. Really unlucky. Almost got his second of the game. Good to have Downing back, being injured for a while. Hasn't been amazing. Uh, they, I guess SI Sports Interactive updated him so he could play central midfield, attacking midfield at the last minute and haven't really shown his true, well, ability um, as, as what he's showing in real life. So we're 1-0 up. Things are going well. We can do better, though. That is true. I'm going to swap Zerate and Valencia around, see if that makes a difference. I'm going to put Zerate as 
a a triquista. You never know how to, never know how to pronounce that word properly. And Valencia will be a poacher, I think. We'll, we'll just we'll just test this out and see what happens. Zerate, I mean, Sacco's just behind them in the target man support role. So I'm not sure there's really essential for a, another deep lying forward. Oh, Downing, come on, win it. Valencia, it's a bit of a scramble there in midfield. Song, lovely ball out to Jenkinson, who's playing wide there. Full back and poor cross that time. Easily picked off by Randolph. Trippier's a great right back. Remember, I enjoyed my Burnley career on FM 14. Was it FM 14? I've forgotten. Was it FM 13? Ings was a beast anyway, as was Trippier. Okay, time to make some subs. Downing had better come off because he's uh, only just come back from injury. But I'll put Noble into his role and Poye on. And then uh, Sacco's a bit tired, isn't he? Let's give Carroll another chance. Let's assertively say, show me what you've got. I want a good performance. Because I do. We need him to score. Zerate, free kick. Lobs it in, Carroll. Valencia scores. Worked well there. Tenth goal of the season. Three strikers with uh, ten goals this season. Carroll has none. But at least the three new signings that have come in, in uh, obviously in real life, Sacco, Valencia and Zerate, they've all performed really well on this save, fantastic stuff so last sub bring off Noble possibly for, for Morrison who's I'm giving him lots of game time, hasn't done a huge amount but he's got that potential unfortunately I think he doesn't really want to sign a new contract and I'm not sure whether to sign him, uh, well I'll give him a new contract, but I think I will because if I play him and keep developing him then he will turn into a good player, <laughs> what was that? Uh, here goes Zerate, down the wing, ooh, over the bar, unlucky. <coughs> oh, we're actually, we've actually won a game, oh, that's incredible. Can we make it three? Oh, almost, off the line by Trippier. And 2-0 victory, comfortable 2-0 victory. This tactic generally is quite solid defensively, which is surprising, because I haven't managed to find anything like it on FM15, so many goals, but this is working reasonably well. It's keeping the scores down, despite looking very attacking with three up front. It seems to be working okay. And we're up to seventh place. We're level with Southampton over game in hand on 37 points, but one point above Everton, five above Liverpool, and six above Sunderland in 10th. So we should be top 10 because, I mean, Stoke are eight points below us in 11th place. So 10th place. Top 10 should be comfortable this season, which is good. That's what I was hoping for. Uh, we may be able to push for Europe. That's could be a bit tricky, but you never know. Um, at last we've won a game. Thank goodness. Okay, well thank you for watching. Please leave a like if you want a new episode up as soon as possible. Uh, please subscribe so if you haven't done so already. And comment your thoughts. Maybe you think my tactic's a bit weird and doesn't really work and it's that's why I lost against Palace but it works against Burnley so you know may change the striker roles though because it seemed to work a bit better after that anyway thanks guys and see you soon